All right, so welcome to How To Dino. And today this video is gonna be a little bit different. Now this is still a custom command tutorial type video, but the difference here is that this is a community made custom command featured by hello hi 821 I am now going to feature your custom commands. So if you have an interesting custom command, feel free to uh, comment down below the command and then what you use it for and how it works. I can't wait to see your commands. I feel like we're gonna have some interesting stuff. Maybe down the line, I might hold some type of contest where the winner might win Nitro or something like that. But for now, you will be featured in my videos. I will basically be giving you a shout out, so to speak. So feel free to comment your Discord name along with your custom command. So yeah, so feel free to comment your Discord name along with your custom command, how it works, and what you use it for. So hope you guys are excited for this. Don't forget to comment your unique custom command. And I look forward to going through them. I guess let's get into the video. So this is a fairly easy command. It's nothing too complex. It's just using the temporal command. To begin, head over to the dino bot dashboard, dino.gg. Head over to manage servers. Click on the server you'd like to manage. Head over to custom commands. Let's go down to custom commands. And ooh, this is new. So it looks like we have a bit of a new interface for custom commands. I don't believe they've made any announcements on this, but interesting. It looks like we get to actually view the command by just clicking on the view and edit. So it's the usual stuff, but it's just a new form factor. So this is new, a little unexpected, but uh, I'm just gonna remove that and actually add our command. So the name of this command, once again, you guys can name it whatever you like. And also it looks like there's a new description. So we are just gonna go ahead and name the command reward, uh, just to follow Hello Hi's format. And uh, it looks like you can actually add a description detailing what the command actually does. So if you'd like to use this new feature, go for it. And then for the command, you can find it in the description, just copy and paste. If you're on mobile, I do have a pastebin link down there for you. Uh, I did add delete just to get rid of the actual command trigger. But basically, we're just going to temporarily add the reward role to the user that we mentioned. And then this right here is the reasoning. So we're just saying that the reason why we're adding this role is because they were the contest winner. If you have another role you'd like to supplement uh, just go ahead and change this highlighted area to the role name. When I post the command in the description, I'll probably change this to role name and then reason in all caps just so you guys can tell what does what. And then to actually change the length, so we're only applying this rule for seven days. We can also change this to five if we wanted or five minutes even. But for now, we'll keep it at seven days. And that's pretty much it. So next we're just going to hit add. As you can see, we've successfully been able to add the command. Let's go ahead and refresh it here. There we go, reward. Now all we have to do is test out the command. I'll see you guys over in Discord. All right, so here we are in Discord. In order to get this command to work, we need to create the role. So if you're following along, let's follow my steps. So I'm clicking on the server name, heading over to server settings, roles, create role. And we're gonna name this role since this is what we entered into the custom command. Now, if you're using an already existing role, you just simply update the custom command to the name of the existing role. But since we're trying to follow Hello Hi's example, I'm just going to keep everything the same. I'm gonna go ahead and save changes. And now let's go ahead and test the command. In order to use the command, type reward, followed by the user we like to assign the role to. 
And now, as you can see, Dino has successfully added the roll. And that's the custom fan. It's as simple as that. Now keep in mind, this is a temporary roll. So I will only have this roll for seven days and then Dino will go ahead and remove the roll after those seven days. So that's the basics of the command. Hopefully you guys found this video interesting. And don't forget to post your custom commands down in the comments. I'd like to see those. All right, so thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe.